going on everyone? It's Brainwitch Code You Find Jewelry, your personal jeweler. In this video, I want to break down the comfort factor while wearing a chain and a big thing that affects that is the finish on a chain. So we're going to break down diamond cut versus plain, the pros and cons, and which one is right for you. With that being said, let's get started. You can use the same idea no matter what the chain style is, diamond cut versus plain. I'm going to use the Franco, for example, the 5mm in this video because I don't sell plain ropes. I only sell diamond cut and that goes a lot with the chains that I sell. So I just want to use the diamond cut versus plain and that is a very popular chain and the question is asked frequently as well. So number one, in case you're just trying to get all the facts together, which one is right for you? And I don't know if this matters, but diamond cut outsells plain by a lot. Diamond cut is very popular. We're going to break that down in the next clip. So if you're kind of just wondering which one you want and what everyone else is wearing, diamond cut by far is the most popular. And I say that just because I want to offer you guys the most points as possible. It does not matter what the next person wears. It's whatever you want. And when you watch videos like this, you'll kind of get a better idea of what you want. I just want to give you everything that I possibly can to help you out. Now, the diamond cut is very popular for a reason. It looks great. Now, if you're holding your hand in the showcase around the neck, it sparkles. I'll put the B-rolls. I've made so many diamond cut videos. You could just search and watch all night all the diamond cut videos. But across the screen, we're going to compare the 5mm diamond cut Franco to the 5mm plain Franco. And what makes the diamond cut sparkle is those faceted edges that makes it also look a little different. It's more rounded compared to a boxier plain Franco. So you have a a, a little bit different look visually. You got more of a rounded link compared to a boxier link, but more or less they look the same. The diamond cut really catches the sunlight and shine. So that's why a lot of people like it. No matter what the size is, you're getting an overall shiny chain. And we all like that shiny gold. So it's high quality. It looks, it stands out. So I think that's why a lot of people like the diamond cut because of that shine factor. With the shine back comes the drawback of the diamond cuts catching on your shirt, maybe irritating your neck rolling around. This isn't a big deal. I very, very, very rarely hear about it. A lot of people get the diamond cut. Love it. If you have a diamond cut chain, drop a comment down below and let people know your honest reviews and feedbacks of that chain because it's not a huge deal, honestly. But that plain version is the safe bet. And what I like to recommend to people, the plain version, if you're just looking for a very high quality chain to wear and then not worry about it because against the skin, it feels awesome. Awesome. The 5mm Franco against the skin or any size Franco against the skin, it is a great feeling. There's no sharp edges. It's just high polish, top quality merchandise that you'll love. You don't get the shine factor of the diamond cuts, but in this B-roll across the screen, you'll see the 5mm Franco is still catching that sun, shining because of how high quality they are, the Jacoji Francos. That's just the way they are. So if you're very particular on how it's going to feel on your skin, the, the, the plain version Franco is far superior because it's just so smooth and it feels nice across the skin and it's not going to catch on your clothing. When you're really trying to compare chains, diamond cut versus plain, no matter what the chain is, the plain version always is going to be more comfortable. So if that's what you're looking for, then go with the plain version. And again, it's going to look good as long as it's a high quality new chain. It doesn't matter. The diamond cut obviously adds a little more sparkle to it, but the plain version, it should shine as well. If it's a high quality chain, so I wish I sold the plain rope so I could really see like the diamond cut versus the plain and how popular they are. But as far as like my knowledge of going into this video, I'm really comparing the diamond cut Franco versus the plain Franco because those are really popular chains. And the plain version is kind of getting a little more popular lately, but by far that diamond cut version because of the sparkle and the shine. And again, I'm here to tell you that I've worn both diamond cut Francos and plain Francos. To me, I don't really know notice the difference as far as wearing them. I'm not like, geez, I wish this thing was plain so I didn't feel it. When I put my chain on, I really don't notice it. Um, the only little things I notice is if it gets certain shirts can catch on with the diamond cut and that's the same because all the chains are diamond cut pretty much the same way. Some are better than others and they can catch on the clothes just because of those facets to create that diamond cut. So that's what you have to notice. I'm not real sensitive on my neck. It doesn't itch me or anything, but some people are really sensitive. So if you are and you know that, then obviously go with the comfort wear that plain version. Guys, drop a comment down below if 
if you have experience with a diamond cut chain or a plain chain, why you chose either or, the pros, the cons, and your just personal opinion like I shared my opinion. It's to help the greater good. I make these videos to help you guys out. Make that decision in a tough search. A lot of money to buy the right gold chain for you. That's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you on our next jewelry video.